Yes, Timine. You do. I mean, look around you. For some reason, you tried finding emotional security in Papa. From Papa to indirectly chasing Sister Joy away from the fellowship to deceiving Sister Ify and insulting Sister Miracle. Dealing with every sister that as much as took interest in Papa. And now, Brock Kennedy is your next prey. I don't know how else to explain this, but yes, you totally have spiritual insecurity. The Bible says that they that know their God shall be strong and do exploit. Do you even know your God? Because if you ask me, I do not think that you will be chasing after all of these things if you really know God. We need to retrace your steps. No, you need to retrace your steps. You started out all right. This wasn't how it was supposed to be, but you lost focus along the way. And that's okay, really. You've made some mistakes, and that's fine. But we need to move on. The ones that can be corrected, we correct them. The ones that can't, you ask God for forgiveness, and we move on. Let us work on you. Let us try to make you a better person. That way, you don't have to look for some papa or some bro Kennedy or bro anything to make you feel like you, you, you are worth something. Eh? Let's work on you. Let's boost your confidence. Let's make you into a good woman. That way, the men will come chasing after you and not the other way around. Your background has happened to you. It happens to the most of us. But honey, you have to move on. Okay? I'll be praying for you. You know I always do. I love you very much. Explanation is gone, my friend. If not, man, no one will see your cellar. Oh, Mister, I got to your BG place. The brother saw me. He said, "Fine, what are you doing?" So, keep so. quiet. <laughs> I sent you on an errand that should take you barely two minutes. <laughs> eh? To your BG place, and you came back here. Not only delay me. Also, you came back with a man wrapping his hand around your bum bum. Mom, you told me about my waist. Egg by me. Your waist. Oh, shafe your mo come on. Oh, fe your mo come on. Oh, no one any fresh. Oh, no one need bath. You want to end up like me in your father's house? Ah. Okay. Just be coming. 
I'm I'm sorry, sorry. Mom, please, I'm sorry. Uh, where is the money? The money I asked you to go and collect from your baby. Ah. Uh, is it that brother? <laughs> Again, you tell me I was to not get lost. Yeah! Hey, baby! Uh. Ah! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Oh, please, I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. You should be there. You should be there. You should be there. Oh, yeah! I mean, not. I go lotty run, tap off my run, you pass lotion run. If you think you go lotty, you pass lotty. You go lotty, you go lotty run. If you think you go lotty run, you go lotty. Ah, hurry, hurry, die la ro. Enjoy, enjoy. Bo, let me tell you, if two are quite push, two are my big bad guy. One will lay. Emergency, you know you need die. Why you continue my shit for me? Ah, you don't lay me. Ah. Oh, je l'ai fumé. Why did you do this to yourself? Why? Why, Timilani? Why? Why? That don't loan you. Oh. Eh? Why talk to me? Talk to me. Talk to me and your mother. I'm sorry. Ah. Oh. Well, my heart hurt, knowing you have been hurt, and I'm trying everything possible to forgive myself for the mistake we both committed. I took time off to be with the Lord, and I think the best thing for us to do is to confess openly at the fellowship and serve the necessary punishment so this terrible sin does not stand against us in future. Thanks. I expect your favorable reply, John. Daddy, eh? good evening, sir. Ah, 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 ah. Evangelist. Yes, sir. Good evening. Good evening. Yes, sir. Um, mommy, is she in? My wife did not say she won't be around. Oh, I forgot. Uh, well, if that's the case, sir, let me be on my way. I will check back tomorrow. Okay. Yes, sir. Wait. Evangelist, come. Do you know of all my wife Christian friends, I really like you. Oh, thanks for the honor, sir. I'm grateful. You'll be a good husband for my daughter Tim Lane. Oh. Hey. Do you think I did not know you like her? Oh, it's a bit she wish one day. I used to see you the way you act after her for my younger brother, Farouk. And I've caught you on different occasions. Staring at that picture. You, 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 mo <laughs> you must have been monitoring me, sir. Eva. What did I mean? She was showing me a But do you know before now, I vow that Milan will marry a Muslim like me. So that she can correct the mistake that I make in marrying a mother Christian. Do you know our religion differences have been the foundation of a marital failure? But I know everything. So I did not want Timilene to make the same mistake. And she had chosen her mother part Christianity. So, it would be nice for her to follow that path and marry a Christian like herself. So, Evangelist, so, I give you my permission. Well, I wasn't expecting this. Uh, um, I appreciate you, sir. I'll, uh, I'll, uh, uh, it's fine, sir. So, just give me time to think about it. Allah will help you. May Allah help I you. trust God, sir. Allah will help you. And right. guide your step. Right. Thank you, sir. You my, are welcome. My girl's tomorrow when she's back. I will. Yes, sir. Think about it. <laughs> All right. Huh? Hello there. I'm sorry I had to stop your movie halfway. Apologies, but this will be very quick. I have this information I want to pass across real quick. 
My name is Okoyemi Akitunde. I am the writer and producer of the ongoing series that you're watching, Him, Her, and I. By the special grace of God, I have written 20 novels, which has been a blessing to the body of Christ. And we have made two adaptations of those novels, Him, Her, and I, and Stepping Into My Shoes. So, I need a big favor from you. I'm sure you're going to watch the favor. The scripture says that by one man, the house is built. But God is the builder of everything. And I know that God lives in you, God lives in you, and God lives in you. So by helping us to build this ministry, it means that God is building through you. I'm sure you're wondering, how can I help to build this ministry? Very simple. Just two things I need from you. The first one is that you need to help us build this YouTube page so that we can minister to more souls. We can reach out to a lot of people. And you're wondering, how? It's very simple. YouTube believes that when you like our page, when you comment, and when you subscribe, it means that that particular channel is worth watching. So by clicking the like button, by typing that comment, by subscribing, or by sharing to friends, you're simply telling YouTube that they should recommend this video to other people. That way, this family will grow. So please help us to build. That's the first one. And secondly, I'm sure you're wondering how you can support us further in building this ministry. It's by helping us financially so that we can make more gospel movies. Thank you so much for supporting us in making more gospel movies. God bless you. So get back to your movie and watch it too. Hello. I'm coming to your place right now. What do you mean I can't come to your place? Where? Excuse me, what was that about? No, what was that stupid message that you sent me? No, no, no. <laughs> no, I, I just want to believe that you were not in your right senses when you sent that message to me. Because if you were in your right senses, you would not send me that stupid message. John, are you okay? I got pregnant for you. And you begged me to abort the pregnancy. You even swore to me that you would not betray me. Then out of the blues, after I've gone through the emotional and physical pain of committing the abortion, you come and say that we should, I don't get, go to the campus fellowship and, and what? And confess open. I and mean, who does that? <laughs> no, who does that? I want to hear. Who does that? Sing to me. Sing to me. I'm, I'm really, really sorry. I, I know how this has made you feel. Trust okay. me. But to me, I, I feel God is not happy with us. See, Proverbs 28, 13 clearly states, you will never succeed in life if you try to hide your sins. Confess them. Give them up so that God will show mercy to you. To me, this is this is <laughs> John. So if I understand what you're saying, you're saying that we should go in front of the campus fellowship, in front of the congregation of students, and somehow tell them that you and I slept with each other, and I got pregnant. And I committed the abortion. Is that what you're saying? Yes, to me. It's that simple. You call that simple? No, you call... Yes. It's actually simple for you as a guy. Because you know what? You will just walk away after this whole thing. But I, as the lady, I will be seen as the prostitute. I will be seen as the loose girl. I will be seen as the murderer. And nobody will see you. 
as the victim. I will be the victim. Don't you get that? No, I'm not away with it. Seems like you don't understand. The news will go around the, the, the campus. People will start tagging me as that girl that slept with her spiritual father and got pregnant and they went for an abortion and they came. Did you, did, you, did you even consider all of these things? And you will go ahead, get married, and I'll become an old mistress and somehow you have not thought about it that in the future I will want to get married and my future husband or future brother in law will say, that girl got pregnant in school, aborted for a spiritual. Did you, have you thought about that? No, have you thought about that, brother Jim? Have you, have you considered that? Timmy, you have to really take this easy on yourself. I'm trying hard. I'm really trying hard, Timmy. I'm trying hard. But I can't, I can't keep this to myself. Timmy. I can't keep it to myself. I'm trying my best to be very, very sensible. Why are you being insensitive? No, you're being insensitive. To me, on the contrary, I'm trying my best to be very, very sensible. But if you insist that you're not going to come out, or you're not going to join me in confessing to the congregation or coming out to the open, to me, you, you need not to worry yourself. I will do it myself. And I promise I'm not going to mention your name to anyone. Can you think... <laughs> People will not know that I'm the woman. Do you think they won't know that it was with me you committed the fornication? Do <sighs> John, I beg you. I beg you. I beg you. I promise you. I promise you, please. I promise you, I'll, I'll stop following you. Please save my face. Timmy, get up. Save my face. Timmy, no, get up, get up. Timmy, get up. Get up. I'll stay away from you. Please. Timmy, that's not the point. You know what? I've made up my mind. And I've decided. Timmy, I'm coming out to the open. You don't have to be there. I have to confess. I have to. Please. Tell me, what is it? What? What is it? Sister Timmy, what happened? Um, I told bro, John about the abortion and he was very angry and, and disappointed in me. Did you tell him you were raped? Yes. I told him I was gang raped, but he was more concerned about 
the abortion. In fact, Bro John said I am a sinner and that he doesn't want to ever have anything to do with me again. Sure, <laughs> you know what? I want to apologize for walking out on you the other time. I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. Bro, John shouldn't have done that. I mean, it is not your fault. <laughs> Sister Timmy, I want to promise you that if everybody, I mean, if the whole world turned their back against you, I will marry you. Not considering the rape and the abortion, as long as you're willing and you are ready to marry me, I will marry you. <laughs> It's the team. It's okay. Stop crying. It's okay. So, Bro Kennedy is ready to marry me despite my ugly past. And, Bro John, <laughs> you want to expose me? <laughs> mm, never. This is a do or die affair. John. You have done enough by trying to destroy my life. I was only building castles in the air with you. Listen, John, it is my turn to destroy your life. You're my half of a coin, I've been searching for a long time And I know in this lifetime, I cannot dare to lose you And it's you, my love I've been suffering in silence, cause it's you I want I just wanna let you know, oh no You're my right to die, I just got to try It's you I swear on my life 